there's several times I've been on some safaris. They have safaris where you can do a walking safari. They have walking safaris. It's the most ignorant shit I've ever seen. <laughs> the reason that you're on the Range Rover is because the animals have gotten accustomed to the Range Rover and they see it as one object. As long as you sit on it and don't stand up and wave your hands, they see it as a non-threatening and not a food source. So as you can walk, drive right up next to a pride of lions and they'll lay there. As long as you don't make yourself look like an individual, if you do that, your ass is gone. <laughs> but if you sit on that truck and just look and don't be loud, you can watch all the animals. But they have these tours where you can walk. I just don't understand this. So we got to the Grand Malawali Lodge and they said, well, Mr. Harvey, would you like to tour? And I said, well, yeah. And he says, well, your first tour will be at 5.30 this evening, get ready for a sunset tour. So I go out to the Range Rover and there's four other people out there. I said, who the other people? He said, well, they're on the Range Rover too. I said, oh, no, 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 no. I said, I just want my family on the truck. He said, well, Mr. Harvey, those are the other guests at the lodge. Well, this ain't the only truck you got. You can give me another truck. Cause see, my family do what I say do. You say don't stand up. When I tell my family not to stand up, they ain't gonna stand up. Give me them damn people I can't control. They're over here standing up, taking pictures with their ignorant ass. You know how other people are, they're stupid. You don't like other people cause other families ain't like you. They stay up taking pictures. Ah, this is great. Hey, said sit down, man. And see, I don't have this So I said, no, I want the truck by myself. So Mr. Harvey, uh, we do this all the time. I said, I don't care what you do all the time. How much is it to pay for the extra guide and the extra truck? Because I got extra. <laughs> He's, oh, uh, is you, are you going to want this the entire time you're here? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> My family not riding with no other family because people don't listen. So we on the tour. It's another camp that had a tour. There's a lion that's on a keel eating. A guy stands up on the Jeep to take the picture. They've told every, now I'm watching them from about here, or here to that back wall. We a little ways away, we say. They don't see this leopard that's watching. All of a sudden the leopard sees the man stand up. The leopard springs right at the guy. The, the black guy driving snatches him down the leopard goes clean over. He was attacking the man because you stood up and made yourself an individual. I look, I turned to my whole family. I said, if you stand up on this, I swear. <laughs> you know, they stopped for a little evening lunch, wine and cheese. We eat our wine and cheese on the truck. You know, they set the little cart up in the back where you can stand around. They had a guard out there watching. No, nah, no. Nah. The Harveys is eating their cheese on the truck, and don't turn this off either. Keep everything running. <laughs> Sir, we can just cut the engine off. No, we can't. 